July 20th, 1969. Two astronauts step into history. Neil Armstrong and Buzz Aldrin. Ready to walk where no one has ever walked before. But among all the high-tech NASA gear, there's one thing on their wrists that NASA didn't build. A mechanical watch. Years earlier, NASA realised if their astronauts were going to the moon, they'd need a timepiece that could survive anything. So they gathered watches from the world's top brands and tried to destroy them. Extreme heat, cold, massive vibrations, pressure tests, shocks. Most watches failed miserably. All but one, the Omega Speedmaster. That's how it earned its ticket to space. And during Apollo 11, every astronaut wore one. Now, here's the twist. When Neil Armstrong took his first step on the moon, he didn't wear his watch. He left it inside the lunar module as a backup timer. So the first watch to actually walk on the moon, it was Buzz Aldrin's Omega Speedmaster. That single moment turned a tool of precision into a piece of legend. From the chaos of rocket launches to the silence of the moon, the Speedmaster didn't just tell time, it made history. If you could take just one watch with you to the moon, which one would it be?